when the budget was approved, we were approved for three new positions for the fire department. Um, that way we can put an additional man on each shift. We've gone to 13 minimum manning starting October 1 from 12, uh, so that we can put three people on the ladder truck every day instead of two. And so uh, we still had an active exam, a written exam. We had 15 people to invite today for the physical building test. We had 12 show up. And so uh, we're looking to fill those positions. Uh, a three-man company is a whole lot safer. Uh, we only go in in pairs at all times. And before, we only had two on the truck. We didn't have an officer, so this will, uh, when we promoted the lieutenants, that gave us an officer. But this will allow us to have a three-man crew. That way, we still have, when the two men go inside, we still got a man to run the ladder truck. Well, so far, we've had uh, only one pass out of the first four, but uh, that's pretty typical. Last time, we only had 40% pass. Our physical agility test is very tough, but it is doable. We make every one of our guys take it every year. They all have to pass it every year. And so we've got everyone in our departments uh, in shape and able to pass it, so we expect these young men to be able to do the same thing. Well, they have to connect several sections of hose together and drag a dry line, and then they have to drag a uh, charged hose line, come around the front of the tower, they carry a hose pack up, uh, simulating a high-rise hose pack. Uh, then once they're upstairs, they pull three sections of hose over the balcony, come back down to raise a uh, roof ladder, a 14-foot ladder, climb to the top of it. They go to the extension ladder and raise it to the top. Come over to another extension ladder and climb it to the top and back down. And then they drag a dummy, uh, some uh, probably about 40 yards. When we did the last round of hiring, uh, we actually gave conditional offers of employment to two men, more than five that we would hire. Uh, we contacted those two men. One of them has accepted the position in Athens. So really need to hire two out of this group is what we're looking for. Just, you know, really appreciate the support of the public and so forth for our fire department. It's just, you know, we're trying to grow and get to a safer and uh, more manageable uh, staff so that we can serve the public better. This has been a video production of the Walks at G Daily Light. For more articles about Ellis County, go to the Daily Light's website at walksatgtx.com. This has been Andrew Branco reporting.